Vicroads has issued a blunt warning to truckies after an overheight semi-trailer carrying hay struck Richmond Swan Street Bridge. As Jonathan Kersley discovered, the interstate driver was trying to avoid tolls when he overturned. Another day, another overheight truck hits a Melbourne bridge, causing early morning chaos. It's Punt Road that's the worst affected. No queues as you come past the Eastern Freeway. It was two o'clock this morning when the truck, carrying hay and weighing 42 tonnes, struck the Swan Street Bridge and tipped onto its side. The South Australian driver was uninjured, but his blunder spilled bales and diesel, led to road closures, tram cancellations and traffic gridlock. Police say the driver was en route to Gippsland and trying to avoid toll roads. This is very frustrating. Um, for motorists. Would have been better off going via City Link. It's a greater clearance through there. It's the first time in five years the bridge has been struck. Low clearance signs of 4.1 metres, not enough to prevent this latest mishap. Some commuters say more warnings are needed. Well, yeah, I suppose there's only one on that main bridge there. After six hours, the street was reopened. The driver won't face any charges or fines. The Swan Street Rail Bridge isn't the only structure causing a headache for Vic Roads, with the rubber paddles hanging from the gantries at the Montague Street Bridge in urgent need of repair, only weeks after being installed. Authorities say it's an example of why they're needed in the first place, but truck drivers are on notice. Know the height of your vehicle and know the clearance of the, of the bridge that you're going to travel under. Jonathan Kersley, Nine News.